Hello, I'm Freddie Jackwin. I'm a hypnotherapist. I've made this little video just to speak for a while about pain control or pain elimination, and in particular, how hypnosis can help people achieve that. When we speak to the general public about hypnosis, they'll say, oh yeah, that helps people quit smoking, or that helps people lose weight. And of course it does. But when we're talking about pain control or pain elimination, that seems to be a different level of understanding. How can just speaking to someone help them overcome a lifelong chronic pain? How can speaking to someone help them have an operation without any anesthesia or have dental work done without any anesthesia? That seems, even to me, who've been doing this for years, still seems crazy. Now, people say to me, Freddie, you've helped thousands of people. And they say, you know, I've helped them overcome this, overcome that. My belief is that I don't actually do anything. I have a learned ability, which anyone could learn as far as I know. All I think I do is act as a catalyst. In fact, it's what I know I do. I act as a catalyst to help that person get in touch with their own ability to change, their own ability to quit smoking, lose weight. One of those abilities that we have is the ability to shut down or ignore useless, unnecessary pain. Now we know this happens under certain circumstances. People will ask me, how does the arrow work? Which is a technique I developed purely for chronic pain. It's now being used for many other things. But when I developed it, it was for purely for, for a chronic pain, helping people overcome that. And people say, how does it work? I've had eminent surgeons ask me that question, who are using it? Now the truth is, I have no idea how this works. And to my knowledge, uh, medical science don't have any idea either. How can your words help someone eliminate pain? It doesn't make any sense scientifically. But what we do know is that we all have an innate ability to shut down or ignore pain under certain circumstances. If your life is an immediate threat, if, if there's a threat on your life immediately right now, in that moment you won't feel any pain. I worked with a man when I was in my teens. Now this guy had been a young soldier in the early 1950s in the Suez crisis. And he was telling me about this time when he was running across some no man's land under fire, so there was bullets whizzing everywhere. And he said he felt something hit his foot. He assumed it was a stone, so he just kept running. Now he ran for 50 yards and he dived behind a wall under sort of relative safety. He looked down at his foot, there was a bullet hole through his laces. He turned his foot round and the back of his heel had been blown away by his bullet. Yet he'd run for 50 yards with no pain. Now in that moment when he was under fire, some part of him, his survival part of that man, said, this is no time to look at this, just keep running. So we know that under certain circumstances, we can ignore or shut off pain. Now I believe that hypnosis, whether it's my technique, the arrow, whether it's some other wonderful techniques like drain the pain, old pain to go. There are many of them that do this really well. I believe that all we're doing as hypnotists is helping that person tap into that natural ability to shut off or shut down useless, unnecessary pain. So that's my feelings on this. People continue to ask me how it works. I'm gonna to continue to say the same thing. All I do is help that person get in touch with their own ability to shut that pain off. If, if you like, put it another way, we're helping them give themselves permission to ignore it. And for whatever reason, this can be done in minutes. It doesn't take days or weeks. And we don't need pills or potions. We have an opiate um, epidemic at the moment. People are dying in their droves from overdosing on pain relief. Hypnosis can help that. And I believe that sooner or later, and I think it's going to be sooner rather than later, the medical world are going to look at what we're doing as hypnotists. They're going to understand it and they're going to go, we're going to use it. That's my dream, not just for my technique, but for all the other wonderful pain control techniques that are being used out there that don't involve pills or potions. So that's my little video for today. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm Freddie Jackwin, freddiejackwin.com. Look forward to speaking to you again soon.